good day everyone so today i'll be showing you how to make a simple coat using your pixel lab so first of all you head down to your browser now once you're in your browser you search for code block and then you go to images now once you do that you look for things like this that look like a code block let me see if we can have anyone so you can see another one here so now let's make use of this one so i will enter here now you can use other code blocks here you can see them there's as many as you want but i'm going to make use of this so you right click on it you longer you press and hold until you see this option comes out then you download it so i've downloaded that's why it's telling me to download again so i'm going to download so you can see them you can download all of them if you want to now once you have downloaded them the next thing still on your browser you go to you go to remove dot bg so next you upload image you go to upload image and then you select now this is the one i want to do you select it and you press done now you allow it to remove the image now it has removed the image the next thing you download it so now it's downloaded so i've downloaded it the next thing you go to your pixel lab so now depending on the kind of background you want you can change your background here or simply you can make use of color like me i prefer to make use of a colored background so let me just pick a bright background so let me see and uh, so i'll just use this colored background i'll remove this text so now next you go to your add button that's your plus and then you go to from gallery so you go to your add button then from gallery so now you see this is this is picture here now you can resize it if you want i'm going to resize it here so be careful while resizing it so that you not take off the most important part so now you can see it you can still see my coat there now i want to remove this coat this is just what i need that's the code block itself so what i'll do now i'll come to this place then i'll scroll until i see eraser now this is eraser i'll pick my eraser now i'll increase the size here since what i'm erasing is quite much which is this so i will carefully erase it now make sure you don't erase the most important part which is the code block you only erase this text so once you are done erasing it then you can just press good now you can see my code block so from here now it depends you can also add a background it mustn't be this white background this color background you can add a background you can add pictures to it um, but if you don't know how to do that probably i'll make another video where you can add your pictures and other things so now this one if you like you can reduce the size or increase it and if you like you can reposition it if you want to position it at the center you know what you should do you should just go to your relative size no sorry not relative size you go to relative position and then you center it this is vertical center this is horizontal center so now the next thing is just for you to go to your add text and then once you press add text you can see the text here so let me drag it here and then let me edit the text wisdom is profitable to direct so here you can if you like you can increase the size yeah so <clears throat> here you can even center it go to your line you center it then you can also change the color where is it Okay, you can add background if you want to. Yeah. If you want to, but I don't want to. Here too, you can change the style. If you want it bold or normal, or you want it slanty. So, then 
you can change the font to here yeah then uh, i'm looking for color i don't know i think it should be somewhere here can read okay this is the color good so i just make it look very black yeah it's not as black yeah i like this black so you can increase it here and then reposition it so if you want to also put this one at the center you do the same you go to your, uh -huh, you go to your relative position and then you center it so now we have a very good and nice looking coat so the next thing to do is to save it you come here you can save it as a project in case you want to come and be re-editing so i'll first save it as a project project name say coat block then next i'll save it as an image save it as jpeg dimension i'll leave it as okay as default if you want to or you can put it very high then save to gallery so that's that image saved now let me go to my gallery and check now we can see this is it wisdom is profitable to direct so this is how you can actually make a good looking code using your pixel lab you don't need to form this code block yourself it's just for you to go online get good and nice looking code block and then follow the process and before you know it you get a very good and nice looking code so please don't forget to subscribe to my channel like my channel comment is there anything you don't understand you can put it down in the comment or is there anything you want me to elaborate more on using pixel lab i'll be glad to do that so thank you and have a good day